Peru News Today All you need to know about to Peru The government abandoned us, compatriots returned to Peru from Israel by their own means. Peruvian citizen Delia Gastonadu denounced that no Peruvian authority helped them return to national territory from Israel and that they were helped by civilians. A group of nine Peruvians returned to Peru from Israel on their own, after the attacks by the Hamas terrorist group. They denounced that they did not receive help from the Peruvian state to be able to return to national territory and that they were helped by civilians. Delia Gastonadui gave her testimony of how she managed to leave Israel and arrive in Peru. She stressed that she, along with eight other Peruvians, was stranded for six days trying to leave Jerusalem. Ella Gastonadui said that, since last Wednesday, at six in the morning, she had to take taxis to get to the border with Jordan. Afterwards, she crossed part of Saudi Arabia by bus, until arriving at the Muscat International Airport, in Oman, a country located in the Middle East. From there, she took a plane to Barcelona and then to Madrid, to later leave for Lima. Her compatriot stated that she was able to return to Peru thanks to the help of people who showed solidarity with her and other Peruvians. The group returned in good health, however, they went through dangerous situations and mistreatment. The guide of Jerusalem, the man who knows all these problems, said it was better not to risk your lives, return as you can. Because the organizers were very good, very noble people who were also concerned about helping us get out, she emphasized. They denounced abandonment of the Peruvian state. Delia Gastonadui denounced that no authority from the Peruvian consulate helped them return to Peru. In fact, she indicated that they felt abandoned by their authorities. There was no one from Peru to help you. The government completely abandoned us. There was no one, she stated. Likewise, she stated that they experienced mistreatment during the trip, the procedure is terrible, they charge you one thing and another, she stated. Delia Gastonadui also stated that at the Tel Aviv airport there were many people wanting to leave for their respective countries. Likewise, she recounted the dangers they went through to be able to leave the place due to the tension in this area attacked by Hamas. Our concern was to leave Jerusalem towards the Jordanian border and cross Jordan. It was at ground level. We couldn't do it by other means, so the organizers hired a bus and took us all out at 6 o'clock in the morning heading to the Jordanian border, she said. During their journey they did not have food, there was no time to feed you because there were no restaurants. There was nothing to buy for us. The first risk was to save your life. There is a lot of security in Jordan and you can't even take a step, she added. Subscribe and follow us on our social networks, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram and TikTok. Peru News Today. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram.